everyone. My name is Aradhana Salva Kumar, and I'm here to present my business case. My business case is AI and Entertainment, or Entertainment 2.0. This includes the film industry, music industry, art industry, gaming industry, sports industry, and performing arts. I want to create a system where you can see your interests through AI-based predictions. Of course, we already have things related to this, but I want to make something more efficient, accurate, and faster. Of course, this will not only be the only thing on this program, it will also have other aspects that I'll dive into later. I chose this topic because when I first started thinking about this event, I started listing down all the possible topics I could talk about, and this is one of them. What's your later, name? I started researching more topics, and I came yeah, across I mean, this topic again, and I actually started considering this topic because it seemed like a very easy and entertaining topic to talk about. I'm also currently taking two music classes. I've been doing band for the past three years and will continue in high school, and I started chorus this year. I also love reading books. Reading books has been my passion since I was very, very young, so it seemed like the perfect, perfect topic for me to talk about. I also thought that this was a very rapidly evolving field and a blend of creativity and technology. I also thought that the audience would easily be able to relate and understand this topic and easily invest in this topic too. So what are the current state of things in this field? From special effects to personalized recommendations, AI is changing the way we experience entertainment. There's a growing interest in using AI in storytelling and a lot of directors are using AI for making movies in the film industry too. Although technology is developing, it holds the potential to reshape entertainment in various exciting ways. For example, entertainment companies are using AI to crunch numbers on what people like to watch. It helps them guess what shows and movies to make, how to advertise them, and who will enjoy them the most. So what are the future opportunities of using AI in entertainment? AI is on the horizon, as I said earlier, bringing new experiences for everyone. Imagine games adapting to your skill level every time you play. Imagine movies and shows more mind-blowing than ever with more mind-blowing effects. Imagine AI composed music that you could possibly really, really love or playlists that match your mood that are created by AI. AI can also inspire artists to make amazing masterpieces. They might even be able to collaborate with them directly. Sports fans could get a real-time analysis from AI but to get a better understanding. Books could come to life with AI that adjust the story as you read. That's okay. So one book. My business will use AI-based technology on multiple fronts in the entertainment industry. I have a specific idea for books. I wanted to create a system where um, you could AI would write books for you based on what you like. There have been multiple times where I felt like reading a certain book, but I didn't have that book in hand, so I wasn't able to read it. Instead, I would have this system where you could enter like your interest and AI would give you the book itself. And the best part about this is that this system would be connected to a 3D printer. So that 3D printer would literally just make the book for you with all the words in it. And another really good part about this is that you can reuse this book too. As you insert it back into the 3D printer, it'll erase the story that's already there and write a new story for you so you're not wasting materials or money. For the rest of the industries that I talked about earlier, I will also do things related to this to make everybody's lives easier. How many of you guys have watched movies that have been literally the same as old movies that you, you have watched before? Yeah? I was expecting a lot more hands. Come on, we've all watched movies that we watched before. Yeah? Okay. Um, I also want to include in my... Um, system that like you can take ownership of what you make so if i'm a director and i make this movie i can take ownership of it so other people don't copy my ideas there's also this thing called 
non-fungible tokens. Non-fungible tokens are basically special digital a special digital certificate that gives you a that gives you ownership of your projects. I want to make this easily accessible, more known, and worldwide so nobody copies your ideas. This also uses blockchain to keep it secure and verified. I want this to help creators of all ages. So what are my revenue opportunities for this business? AI helps make suggestions for what you might like to watch or listen to, keeping you interested in streaming services. It also helps make movies, music, and games faster and cheaper to produce. By understanding what people like, AI helps creators make things that are more of what people like to, wa like to watch and buy. AI can also assist with customer service, like buying, helping you buy tickets or find things online. Additionally, AI can create new types of content like funny videos or computer-made music, which can be sold to make money. Now, how do I plan to utilize the funds I get? I will use 30% of my funds for research and development. This includes refining AI algorithms to explore innovative applications of AI and entertainment. 20% will go into content creation. This will involve producing AI-made music, helping make mu movies, interactive storytelling, and etc. 25% will go into platform development. This includes building user-friendly interfaces, ensuring the scalability and security of the platform, and etc. And the rest, 20% of the funds, will go into marketing and promotion. This will, this will involve digital advertising, promotional campaigns, and etc. So, what are some potential threats that I could possibly face while making my business thrive? AI relies on existing content to create new content that could lead to replicates and uninspired results. AI can reflect the biases present in the, AI, in the data they're trained on. This could lead to unfair or stereotypical portrayals in entertainment. As AI takes more tasks in entertainment creation, some jobs currently done by humans could be affected. How do I plan to negate these threats? I want to make sure the information that AI has learned is fair and balanced. Having a team of people from diverse backgrounds helps spot and fix any biases in AI too. I will train it on lots of variety of things like movies, books, and games. People are great at coming up with new ideas and AI is amazing with data, statistics, so if we work together with AI, I think we'll be able to get a better and a more amazing product than what we have today. AI, as AI helps make entertainment, new jobs will pop up. Focusing on skills like working with AI, telling stories in new ways, and designing fun experiences. AI is good at following instructions, but humans are amazing at being creative, understanding feelings, and thinking critically. The entertainment industry will always need storytellers, directors, and other creative thinkers. Why should investors choose me over the others? Investors should put, pick Entertainment 2.0 or AI and Entertainment because it's fresh, easy for everyone to use, and has big potential. This project uses AI to make watching and making movies, music, and games more fun and personal for you. It's like bringing cool new tech to something everyone loves, having fun. So investing in this project means being a part of making entertainment cooler and more exciting for everyone around the world. Also, this is something that happens to us in our daily lives. We all watch TV, read books, and listen to music every day. This is something you can easily understand and relate to. Now, imagine that this platform has developed a lot and is in a high position. This means that all, new, all the new benefits will most likely reach and deeply affect everyone globally. So this is why you should choose me, Entertainment 2.0, over others. So picture this. You're chilling on your couch, bored out of your mind. 
You open up my entertain, AI entertainment system, take a quick quiz, and bam, it whips up a personalized movie marathon with a soundtrack composed by, composed by the hard teamwork of both AI and amazing movie directors, all while printing out a brand new book based on your mood swings. No more endless scrolling, no more man movie nights, just pure entertainment bliss. This isn't some sci-fi fantasy, it's the future of fun and I'm holding the remote, literally. Investing in this project isn't just about making money, it's about making entertainment a choose your own adventure for everyone. It's about saying goodbye to boredom and hello to where movies write themselves, music reinvents itself and books come alive in your hands. So. I'm telling you, vote for Entertainment 2.0 for a better future, led by Aradhana Savakumar. Thank you. Any questions? Thank you. Remember to vote for Entertainment 2.0.